let's have a look at what it's like for setting up a site using Google Sites. Now we're going to be using the new version. So if you come onto sites.google.com, you come over here and you click on create and you've got an option of classic site or new site. We're going to be using the new site for this preview. So we'll just jump across to one that I've just done a little bit of work on. Um, but you'll see here that the first thing you'll notice is it's a very simple site. And if you want to do things like updating the theme, you come over to the top right hand side and you'll see that there's pretty limited um, styling changes. So if I click on there, if I want to change that font style, you've got three selections in each of them for what you'd like to change. So that's in terms of the theme, what you can change. You can change the different header type and the image as well, but that's quite limited. But for some people, that's going to be um, a bit of a gift, really, just making sure that they don't have too many bells and whistles to change around. The next thing we'll have a look at is pages and navigation. Adding a new page is very simple. Um, let's add one in now. If you want to delete any, like that. So you can see there that we've just added those. Moving the pages around is simple as well. If I want to make that, uh, let's see, I'll just pull it up gently. We'll have that as a sub off that page, a sub heading item. Um, so moving the navigation around is fine. In terms of adding in elements, we have a text box we could add in. Uh, we've got images, embedding a URL, people being able to upload to your site. You can also add in documents from Google Drive and from your Drive folder. You can embed YouTube clips, calendar and a map functionality. So if I added in the map, I might want to have a map off Hawaii. I'll just move that across, click and drag. So very simple to add those things in. We can also add in docs, slides, sheets, forms, and charts. So they're all the things that you can add in. If you're looking for a, a blog functionality, then you'd be looking for something more like um, Google's Blogger um, tool that they've got. In terms of settings, you can come up here and you can see site analytics. Uh, you can also have additional editors on there and you can see a preview of the site up the top. So limited settings but it'll do the job if you're looking for something simple. Click publish and you're ready to go. So a pretty quick tour of Google Sites. They are simple. Some people just use them for kind of intranet for internal use, whilst others are using them as simple information sites. So I hope you've got something out of this quick preview and perhaps it's something that might suit yourself or someone else who needs something that's a pretty low tech solution.